Hi, I'm Shauna Coronado from shaunacoronado.com, and today we have squash. <laughs> We're going to be cooking some crook neck squash. Now, I usually pick it when it is about this size, but I don't know, I had too many meetings, I forgot my time, I was twiddling my thumbs. Whatever happened, I now have this giant squash. What do you do with the giant squash? I'm going to show you today. We're going to cook it up on the grill, absolutely delicious, with a little olive oil, salt and pepper. Oh, remember, I'm going electric. It's better for the environment. I, I love the size of it. It's perfect for a little patio or deck. You got it with this little Cuisinart. All right, once it starts to heat up, then we can start preparing the delicious crookneck squash. Now, cut off the top and save the crookneck top. Chop it up into little cubes. You can use it in casseroles, saute it, absolutely delicious. Slice it. Then the trick is to clean out the seeds on the inside. So you just kind of pull out the seeds. Now what we do is we lay out the crookneck squash as it's cut. We drizzle a little extra virgin olive oil on each one. We're just going to do it right here on our cutting board. Flip it over. Do the same thing on the other side. Whoop, there's the seed. Now you can actually clean all this up and roast the seeds. And they taste a little bit like pumpkin seeds, but they're a tiny bit smaller. All right, then we're going to salt and pepper them to taste. I'm peppering. There's lots of pepper going on here. Ah! Place the crookneck squash on the grill. Close the lid and we're off to the races. We'll be back and I'll show you what it looks like when it's all cooked up. The squash is a sizzling, it's smelling delicious. I'm gonna pull it off the grill. And you know what? We're not serving this with anything. Uh, this is just a side dish. It's delicious and yummy. And plain on, plain on its own, it's a great snack, but I think this is just about as wonderful as you can get for a fresh from the garden side dish.